Here's Vancouver in the 1970s. Had trees everywhere, all beautiful, pretty, looking nice. Absolutely no monsters. They already had the world's shortest tower back then. They must have thought that was real impressive. Things about 90 feet tall. In the 1970s, there were no traffic jams. Life was perfect. Everything was trees and happiness in Vancouver. People was playing the tennis without shirts on, and they weren't very good at it. But uh, they played it. Old ladies wandered around, and leaves fell from trees, and old guys were trying to figure out where that old lady went. Where's that old lady? And here's old guy and old lady. They found each other, and now they're looking at the water, and it's so lovely. God, I wish it would stop snowing. These birds... World's happiest birds back then. Not a care in the world. No traffic jams. And always lots of totem poles that they stole. To show off our beautiful city here. And totem poles. And that was a... Uh, whoa, what the hell is this? I don't think I remember seeing that in Vancouver. Freaking science fiction movie. And for our last stop, we'll go to 1961. Yeah, I'm in 1961. I'm in 1961. I'm in 1961, look at me, get out of my way, log. Yeah, 1961, tying boats and smoking. Say, you got any of that uh, stuff in here from 1961? Why, uh, yeah. Here comes the SS 1961. So, uh, guys, I was uh, telling them over there. Forest fire hazard's pretty high back in 1961. It's coming right for us! Look out! Look out! Oh my! So this is what 1961 looks like. Saboom Sound. Is that even a place anymore in BC? You got any of 1961 stuff? Yeah, right here. Best before 1961. And uh, this here, as you can see, says 1961. Oh yeah, 1961, yeah. Sure is a nice day in 1961, ain't it? Yeah, I love 1961 too. I said 1961 too, ha <laughs> ha Yeah. Uh, oh, look out. There she goes. Sorry, Tree, 1961's the end of the line. We can just calculate a little bit. We can figure out how to get this boat to 88 miles per hour and get ourselves back to 1985. Yep. Yep. Oh, I see. Well, that's bad news. Okay. Well, Jim, 1961's now a high fire year. Dear citizens, please evacuate your town before the year 1961 ends. My God! I can't believe it! Here's Billy practicing how to use a hose. Bad news, everybody. I don't like it either. But the danger rating is extreme in 1961 now. The forest area is closed. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Ah, I see. Yes. Well, turn this rig around. And over the hill, we have a fire. Fire! In 1961, look like this. Here come the people. Forest firefighters racing up the hill. Not wearing Nomex, very little protective gear, just piss cans on their back, no chainsaws, straight into it. Most of those guys were at the bar and then uh, they came in and said, you have to fight the fire or you go to jail. And this guy, well, he probably was better off going to jail, but I think it's over there, but maybe it's over there. Okay. <laughs> Calling all humans. Get on board. You sure this thing can fly? I'm not getting in it with you. I could see my house from here. That's a fire. Here's a guy. He's trying to start a pump. They're spraying water, inch and a half hose. Climbing up on the stuff. Here's the tradition of British Columbia forest firefighting. Guys from the bar. Spraying big water. Don't really know what they're doing, probably. Here they come stumbling down the hill from a job poorly done. But that's why we still have trees today. 
Thanks to Jim and Bob and Bert here, and all the men of 1961. All right, let's go back to the bar. Okay, I'll see you there. <laughs> You're buying. Fine. Well, I say fine. Well, that's British Columbia for you. Keep it beautiful, and subscribe to Joey Only, the Caribou Weather Dude channel.